Eject! Plastic crap! You're doing this to me? Who do you think you are, you piece of plastic shit? Oh. Oh. Bro, you! It is my favorite Alburo movie, it died. What else can I do? It's probably not plugged in. What? Damn. No matter. I can buy a hundred more. Now, Tommy. Each month, a freelancer sails into Vice City and moors his yacht. He sells his cargo to the first boat. I want you to take the speedboat and beat all the other shitheads to it. Then you bring the cargo here. Okay? Let me guess. You thought I could use a guardian angel. I'm just saying, you need to let me in there, my man. Now, you can feed me all this lonely tough guy crap. But I know one day, I'm gonna save your ass, and you're probably gonna wanna kiss me. Wacko. <laughs> what happened there? We got some competition! We tell each other how to live? Recently, my city considered... So, Tommy, we know it was Diaz busted our deal. So why in the hell are we running errands for him? The more we learn now, the less we have to learn when we take this town over. I like your style, man. Real friends. I'm not sure. Let's press the issue. Children should be at home with their parents. It's time for the last man's day. You know how much money I save not having to wear trendy clothes? Read a history book. At the creation of the universe, the Big Bang, everyone was naked, even you. Why do I have to stay behind this divider? Maurice, please. Because nobody is interested in seeing your business. Because we have standards of decency which you are offending. Look at me. I'm jumping up and down. Oh my goodness, get back behind the divider. Please, I'm married. What's so wrong with me? Why do you hate me because I'm happy? Jan, give me a hug. I won't hurt you. And by the sound of things, you're... Watch yourself! They're coming from all over! Discuss! Effort be as fast as you can! Everyone, take your clothes off and feel what it's like to be free of bondage. Everyone out there in Vice City, take your clothes off! If this is the... Eat it! Eat it! Feel the wind from the air conditioning! Ugh! A breeze is so liberating! <laughs> Thanks very much. Now, if you could get back behind that divider, Barry, please. Otherwise, I'm going to have to ask you to leave. Thank you. Uh, now, now sit down. On pressing issues, we think it is very important to respect one another. To treat each other like we would like to be treated. I want a hug. If you don't like the United States, son, why... Eat it! Eat it! People in America today, they call this a cold war, but it's harder than hell. Mark my words, any day now you're sitting in school passing notes and talking about the prom when suddenly you look out the window and there are Russian paratroopers dropping in to take over. What can you do? Run into the woods with your friends? Call yourselves the Wolverines? Put twigs in your hand? Try to beat back the Ruskies? No, you hightail it past the Richard Salvation statue and blast off into space. More trouble up ahead! That's why I suggest anyone who wants the safety and security of your own bunker, give now. Call 866-9-SAVE-ME. We'll get you on the payment plan, and if you're paid in full, what some of this? family will be safe. If not, you may have to choose to save yourself and leave the others behind. Hey, 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 stop selling things on my show. You're not a value sponsor who supports the art of public radio, buddy. I, for one, welcome our new Russian masters. We can learn so much from other cultures. Did you? Good shooting, my friend. You're a real, proper, grade-A lunatic. Well, thank you. See you around, Tommy. Okay, Mr. Lance Vance Dance. 